Hello. Okay, I know the lighting is bad. I'm sorry. I'm in my bathroom. I decided to give Latch Hook a break because after my last little disaster, I'm in no hurry to do it again. So I decided I'm going to try a lace front, which I don't wear wigs because my head is too big to wear a wig. But I was like, ah, what the hell? Maybe this time it'll actually fit. Who knows? I don't know why I thought that. But anyway, I brought the, ouch. <laughs> I bought the uh, Free Choice Equal Amory. Doo, doo, doo. And you can't see by this video, the hair is a 99J, which is like a burgundy color. It probably just looks black in here. I'm going to make another video in a different room. But um, I wanted to come on and just show the wig right now because. Like I said, I have a huge head, so I don't normally wear wigs because they don't fit. And this is no exception. You see where the tabs come to on my head? They're way up here because my head is too big to get it all the way down. Now, that's where they are. I can't get it down any further than that, which sucks because I always wear my hair back in a ponytail at work. So I guess I'll just have to wear a ponytail and kind of keep this hair down covering it or something like that. Now, since I've taken the latch hooks out, I've uh, washed my hair and blow dried it. And like I said, I'm not fully natural, but it's been over a year since I've had a relaxer. So I might as well be natural. I've got like some perm on the ends, but the roots, I say about that much of it is all natural. And it is nappy, 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 nappy. I cannot get a comb through it I can't do anything so like all this puffiness that's my hair so um, what I'm gonna do is get the lady that braids my hair I called her to see if she can braid my hair so I think once she braids it and this will flatten down some and I won't have this big bulk that I have right now so maybe the wig will fit a little better a little bit better but I did want to come on because I've seen all these videos of people trying to curl these lace front wigs and what they come up with does not look like a curl to me even though they're happy with it and they say oh it did curl it does not look like a curl to me it's really bad so I was like well, I'm gonna try and curl this I got a little piece from underneath just because I, I bought this cheap wand because I'm not going to spend a lot of money on a wand that I'm just going to use for a synthetic wig because I'll never use on my own hair. Um, I bought this wand from samsbeauty.com. By the way, I bought the wig from elevatestyle.com. They were like $28. I bought four of them. 99J. I bought F1B33130. Uh, number four and a number four F four thirty seven. But um, so I bought these because I was gonna try and curl it. Because even though I wear it in a ponytail, I don't want this straight ponytail. And who knows, maybe one day I would try and wear it out. So I wanted to try curls. And when I saw the uh, wand online, it said that it went from three eighty five to four hundred. So I assumed that it had a heat setting but I got it today and I look there's no heat setting so I guess what they're saying is we don't know how hot it's gonna get somewhere between 385 and 400 so um, before I went ahead and did a curl in a noticeable place I took a little piece of hair from underneath and I curled it and it actually turned out as a real curl so I'm gonna try another one now that I know that this wand isn't going to burn the hair, I guess. I'm still nervous about it. Ooh, I think that's burning. <laughs> no, it didn't. Alright, here we go again. I don't know how the hell to use these wands. I'm Ouch! <laughs>
Holy freaking freak. That was hot. Okay. I guess if you're a novice at wands, you shouldn't be trying to do it on camera. You want to see the hairline? It doesn't count because my head is too big. But you can kind of see it. Anyway, there's plenty of videos of people showing the hairline. Okay, I'm going to try it with these because these actually do have a heat setting on it. So I'm going to see if I can straighten out the one that I curled. Test at these. Okay. Ouch, mother freaker. It's hot. Synthetic hair holds heat. Gee, Okay, anyway, so it did straighten it out. So. <laughs> okay, I'm ending this video before I hurt somebody, mainly myself. But anyway, I'll come back tomorrow after I get it braided and in better light and my computer will actually be sitting on a flat surface instead of an edge. But so far, you know, I don't mind the wig. It's not bad. It's a pretty wig. I just wish I didn't suffer from gigantic head syndrome and I could actually wear it. But like I said, I'm going to come back tomorrow once my hair is braided and maybe that'll give me a little extra room. And I'm going to try curling it. Okay. Bye bye. <laughs> Hello. I wanted to come on for one second because I was able to do a little curl with the flat iron. So I wanted to show my little curl. It's still not like a curl that I would want, but it lets me know that this hair does curl and I can curl it. I just need to take the time to do it. It's a pretty little curl, isn't it? Alright. Ciao.